From the soccer field to the basketball court to the performance stage, one thing remains the same, the importance of good nutrition. Good nutrition takes education and understanding. That's where the Washington Interscholastic Nutrition Forum comes in. Supported by the Washington Interscholastic Activities Association, Washington Youth Soccer, UW Medicine, Spokane Hoop Fest, and Washington Dairy Products Commission, the WIN Forum hosts four annual nutrition clinics to help educate athletes, coaches, and parents. So I put together some slides today to talk a little bit about the things that will be most helpful for sport performance. Emily Edison, a sports nutritionist and Western Washington Wind Forum coordinator, led a 2009 meeting at the Washington Youth Soccer's Soccer Palooza. She and Dr. Monique Burton, a sports medicine physician at University of Washington Medical Center, addressed the importance of having a plan for game time and meal time. I like for athletes to go into a sporting event knowing this is what I'm going to eat beforehand, this is what I know what, what I know works beforehand, this is what I'm going to eat during the game, this is what I'm going to eat immediately after the game. Having an energy-filled eating plan is important and it starts with breakfast. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day because it's what gets you started for the rest of the day and getting ready to, to fuel your body for your practice, for your competition, and to just have enough energy to get through with all your schoolwork as well. So trying things that have like cereal with a fruit, um, having something like toast and peanut butter and a fruit, yogurt with granola, so that you have a lot of different choices that you can have. In order to make it through practice at the end of the day, you must maintain your energy during the day. That's why snacks and a healthy lunch are important. It's very important that before a game or a practice, athletes are fueled up. So I like for my athletes to make sure that they're getting high carbohydrate, moderate protein, low fat snacks on their way into a practice. The foods that are really important to have before a game or a practice are things like yogurt and granola, um, easy to put together things like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, maybe add a glass of milk to it for a little bit of extra protein. Okay, here we go. Nutrition doesn't stop once the game is over. An athlete must remember the three R's, replace, rehydrate, and recover. One of the quickest options for refueling your body post-exercise is with chocolate milk. There's been some research that has supported the idea of drinking chocolate milk post-exercise. It has the perfect ratio of four grams of carbohydrate to every one gram of protein. And we know that that mixture enters the bloodstream very quickly and allows the muscles to refuel and be ready for the next exercise bout faster. One of my favorite things to have after practice or after a, a run or whatever kind of workout you're doing is, is chocolate milk. And the reason is, is because it gives you the carbohydrates, it gives you fat, it gives you protein. So it's a nice little package of all the perfect things that you need to be able to feel, to refuel your body. Parents also play a key role in their athlete's nutrition. It's important to remember what's right and help the athletes make the proper choices. I find a lot of parents nowadays are find, following a slightly lower carbohydrate diet. And with that, they may not be providing enough carbohydrate for their young athletes. So it's very important that at all meals we provide protein as well as a nice strong carbohydrate source like rice or pasta or beans or bread to go along with dinner to give the kids the energy that they need. Another thing um, that's important with parents is that they go to the store with a shopping list. They really understand that these are the foods that we need to purchase to make sure that the kids have what they need, to, quick and easy things they can throw in their bag. Granola bars, yogurt, string cheese. <laughs> the main message is that you want to have a variety and include all the different food groups. So that does mean that you're getting the fruits, vegetables, you're getting carbohydrates and fats because that is what your body needs to be able to function optimally. To learn more about sports nutrition, visit www.winforum.org. Have a sport nutrition game plan.